Welcome back folks to Untamed California. See right here, I'm laying down single man. I got plenty of cover right here for my mesh. Still able to pull out a book at the end of the day after that long hike. Relax the feet, relax the muscles. Drink plenty of water beside my bed. Camp out sight. Talk to the boys. Still be able to stretch out guys. So now we're gonna go over exactly what we have inside this one man tactical. All right, so we're gonna be giving you a breakdown now of the Katoma tent from the head all the way down to its foot. The thing that I really enjoy about this tent up on top is how wide it is. So it lets you bring a backpack in with you at night, right Tom? See, the reason why he's saying that is because I'm sure, <laughs> right? And I can actually fit my backpack in there. But yeah, that's exactly what he's saying, right? So for us shorter guys that are out on the trail, it allows us to actually kind of enclose our whole system and kind of be more secure you know, and have our backpack and everything kind of organized into one spot. And not only that about the top is all around the tent, you're gonna have these fiberglass poles. They may be tiny, but they are very durable. Um, they do give it the pop as well when you go to open the tent and they're super strong. You may think you broke it. However, sometimes the part down here will pop out. You just pop it in and keep going. Yeah. The next great thing as well is the bug netting all around it. I know we've been in some nasty areas with a lot of mosquitoes. You've been in areas surrounded with ticks, um, especially on the JMT. Remember last summer? We went yeah. through a, like a full on open terrain. I kid you not, you could see the hives of just insects and it was, it was a mess. But I tell you what, a pro when it came to the tactical one man tent right here was the bug net. It saved our lives. We were a lot happier on that trail, right Zach? Oh, it definitely did. And it also yeah. comes with a, a bug spray as well on it. So you do get that for about a year. If that starts wearing off, spray it down again and you'll be good to go for another year. The thing I really love about this tent, which saves a lot of space in your pack, is it comes with this tub right here so you don't have to worry about a foot. It keeps you dry on the most muggy of nights when water's flying down out of the sky and it's surrounding the whole thing and it's about six to eight inches so a good amount of water can be hitting you yeah for and sure. you'll stay dry all night because it's definitely not fun in the morning when you're hiking after a night of being up all night fighting a storm yeah in fact that's one of my big pet peeves on the on the trail guys is just trying to stay dry i know you know some some situations it's almost impossible yeah. But uh, keeping dry is a is a life or death for me. Uh, I know it may sound extreme, but you know sometimes it can be that way. Exactly. So when we're talking about essentials, guys, it's staying dry. It's keeping a warm, you know, full belly, and then also staying hydrated for sure. And this tent definitely lets you do that. So I know I love that tent. Yeah, and, and, and I do too, you know, it's it's definitely military grade, um, it, you know, a lot of guys uh, overseas and, and, and units, you know, here uh, in the United States definitely use them, so it's durable, you know, and, and this tactical tent I think is, is a great starter uh, for anyone that uh, is looking to get right on the trail with that easy setup yeah. system. And that's the thing that we're going to be showing you now is how easy it is to set up and put away. It sometimes looks like a daunting task at first, but practice it at home and you'll be perfect for once you get on that trail so let's give them a, that show right now let's pop it out man I'm tired now There we go. Just put my sleeping bag in there, blow up my mattress, and I'm ready for some dinner after that hike. And now that I've had a nice night's sleep in this tent, it's time to pack it up and try to beat other hikers out onto the trail. So I'm gonna be grabbing both ends, creating a trash can, putting the front end down all the way to the back, makes a figure eight, put it down over top, this part may scare some people, however you're gonna grab it. Start twisting into another figure eight, pop down. You hear some cracks, but it does not damage the tent. You're gonna put your loop over to make sure it's not popping out while you're walking. And this loop needs to be tight on here, so you're not having any 
premature tent blowing up in your pack. Fits right inside the pack perfectly. Now I'm ready to go. I'll see you on the next gear review video.